Carlos es de hype. Sabrosura para ti que Hola, manis. Welcome to Café con Pam, where we share our stories over cafecito. Yo soy la tía Pam, o Coach Pam, and we bring you inspiring stories from first-generation Latinas and people of the global majority in this channel. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button, ring that bell so you never miss our cafecito time. And hey, for more incredible stories, of course, listen to the podcast. Café con Pam, where you can learn more about many other people that we have interviewed. We have so many more episodes that you can check out. But bueno, this episode is all about a summary of what happened in December at the Chicano Federation holiday distribution event. I'm a board member of the Chicano Federation, and this is an organization that I could not wait to get involved with because the moment I arrived in San Diego, over a decade ago, I looked at various organizations that do things for the community and the Chicano Federation was one. So I started noticing and checking out their events and slowly I started getting more and more involved until now I am part of the board of the organization and I'm really proud and I love the work that they do. And I definitely invite you to check them out if you haven't because They have incredible programs. Their whole focus is to make sure that our comunidad is elevated in various ways. From affordable housing, from the free resource center that you'll hear Veronica talk about, workshops, and so many other things that they have so many programs. It's, it's amazing. Y también, algo importante es que todos sus servicios están disponibles en español. Entonces, estos servicios son para la comunidad at large, son para todos, para quien, quien necesite ayuda, tienen de verdad anything that you may think you need help with, the Chicano Federation can probably support you. Acomodar mi desmadre. Bueno, listeners, I also want to give a huge thanks to our friends from Nomono who have been incredible partners and because of our little Nomono capsule, we were able to capture such crisp and clear voices durante este, esta grabación porque, como se pueden imaginar, there was so much noise out there. Y bueno, gracias a Nomono, we were able to, to get like that mm, such good sound. That finally, we're so grateful we're able to do. Entonces, un big shout out to our friends from Nomono for allowing us to make this episode happen. Y bueno, aquí les dejo una, una probadita con las personas que fueron voluntarios para este Holiday Distribution. Yo me enfoqué más a grabar a los voluntarios, al equipo de, de Chicano Federation, a las personas que estaban más involucradas en, en hacer la labor para las familias, porque en realidad para mí no era tan importante necesariamente grabar a... Uh, the families that were receiving the gifts, you know? Entonces, bueno, aquí les voy a dejar el videito con, con el resumen of what happened. We interview board members. We interview Veronica, who she'll tell you who she is. We también hablamos con el, el mayor, con el alcalde de San Diego y con Liz, the CEO of the Chicano Federation, para que ustedes puedan aprender un poco más de lo que hace la organización y y les digo, les digo, esta es una probadita. This is just a little bit of what actually happened. It was really rewarding. It was incredible. And I'm so honored to have taken part in one of the many activities that the Chicano Federation does. Want to check it out? So we're here in San Ysidro. We're doing the annual uh, toy distribution for families here in the community led by the Chicano Federation. It's a great morning, a lot of happy faces made possible because of this great nonprofit that's been serving our community for so long, Chicano Fed. We're super excited and super excited to have you, Mayor, here to join us today. We are at the Chicano Federation Holiday Distribution, uh, handing out all sorts of gifts for the holidays. Everything's flowing pretty well. Yeah, happy, happy faces. Lots of energy. Positivity, holiday spirit. Um, Fernando Ponce, I'm a former board chair for Chicano Federation. Travis Lamprecht, uh, board member, Chicano Federation. 
Alexander Zola, board member of Chicano Federation. We are really excited because we put together a holiday distribution for over 500 families and over 1,300 children that are going to receive food, diapers, toys, books, care packages. And, you know, we're excited because a lot of families go through really hard times through the during the holidays and we have over 120 volunteers that showed up today to help us spread the joy of the holidays and help us you know give out the toys and talk to the families so we are really grateful for all the volunteers all the organizations and everyone who donated whether toys or money so that we can put this together for our families we are really grateful and we really hope that we we gave them uh, a little bit of hope and joy for this holiday season. I am the Director of Development and Community Relations for the Chicano Federation. The people that came to our holiday distribution are mostly the families that Chicano Federation serves through all the programs that we offer, but also it was open to, to the community or community partners and just, you know, every, every time that someone has a need in the community, they turn to Chicano Federation through our resource center. So we were able also to identify some of those families through the resource center and what we see in the community that the needs are. I'm Juan Orozco, I'm a school counselor in the part of the San Diego County Office of Education during the Courting Community Schools program. With our partnership with the Chicano uh, Federation, they gave us uh, stuff for our 50 families, 50 of our metro families. Uh, they're not able to come today because they live in shelters and different programs and stuff like that. So we're gonna deliver to the families. I'm so excited to be able to partner with, uh, with folks like them because you know we wanna make sure that our services are accessible to all families. And if they can't come to us, uh, we're so thankful that we have partners that can go and get them toys, all of the supplies that we're giving out, the resources as well, which is so important that they know that our offices are open to them, not only just this one time of year, but year round that we're here to support families. And we can't do this alone. So we're so grateful to have partners that can share the mission of the organization and share that these resources are available to all of our families. It's just important to be involved in your community, you know, at the end of the day. So anything you can do to help the community, I think is, Always is a positive, back. yeah. Yay. I'm here to simply say thank you to the Chicago Federation and to the volunteers that make sure that in this particular case, a thousand young people who will be served here today, a thousand kids who will get to enjoy the holiday with toys and with food and with other assistance. You know, this is gonna pay dividends all year long, but at this time of year when it's so special, I'm grateful to know that a thousand kids, about 400 plus families, will get to have a wonderful holiday. Then there's a lot of ways that you can support the organization, support the, the community through volunteering or participating in events like this or donating, or just if you want to learn more about all the services that we offer, just feel free to check us out and reach out to us. Okay, Manis, gracias for stopping by today. And remember, always stay shining. Y nos vemos para la próxima. Sabrosura, pa ti, que, que.